Hey y'all, welcome back for another poem of the day. Um, this poem for February 1st is called Blessing the Boats by Lucille Clifton. Stick around afterwards if you want some bonus analysis for help with essays or whatever. <clears throat> May the tide that is entering even now the lip of our understanding carry you out beyond the face of fear May you kiss the wind, then turn from it certain that it will love your back. May you open your eyes to water, water waving forever, and may you, in your innocence, sail through this to that. All right, here's a little bit of analysis for you. Um, I don't want to belabor this one too much because while the craft in it is extraordinary and there's so 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 much going on um, as far as craft and a skill for constructing this um, I also think it's just a poem that I love to just sit with and um, excuse the pun but let it wash over me so um, she's got a couple metaphors obviously that she's working with here there she's working with the tide and the ocean um, and she's working with um, the fa a face to a uh, human body, right? It has she has a lip and the face of fear, and you're kissing the wind. Um, I love this phrase right here. Um, let me turn the pen on. Here we go. The love your back. Um, it's it's a pun on the may the wind love you back. Like um, may you pass set out your love and may it love you back. But it says your back, like your actual back, um, as well. Because I mean that's a I mean, since this is blessing for a blessing for the boats, um, this is a blessing that is written in the structure of the um, "May the road rise to meet you, and may the wind be always at your back." I mean, it's it's not that, but it is using that rhythm and that structure um, as well um, in in a, in a beautiful, beautiful new way. So it's it's also does. Um, I don't know. There's so, there's so much I could say about this, and I don't want to get into it too much. Um, but it's a uh, it's both a prayer, a blessing for the boats themselves, and obviously for the people on them. May you, may you, in your innocence, sail through this to that. That could be referring to the boat, like the physical vessel itself, or it could be referring to the person in it too. Um, and even even the structure of the poem over here like is almost like it's going in and out right like the tide the tide goes in and out the waves coming in and coming out um, there's there's so much and it's so beautiful and um, I'm not going to belabor it anymore so hope you enjoyed uh, hope that helps with essays um, ask questions in the comments if you have more more to say about it but other than that take care of yourselves um, during the pandemic at least wash your hands a lot and wear a mask outside and I will see you next time. This video is a production of Thomas and Morris Instruction. The creators of this video would love it if you would like and share the video and subscribe to our channel to help us goose the YouTube algorithm. Thank you for your support.